Welcome back everyone to another video. Today for some reason we're we'll doing Minecraft. I decided to go on Minecraft and the uh, base my friend Dave and a guy called Fireblade and uh, I decided to pick up his uh, pickaxe and then as a joke I was just gonna run around with it. Decided to kill me with it. So I just well, I just, well not I didn't kill me with the diamond pickaxe. So uh, the, the main reason also I did was just because of how uh, it was basically uh Technically, he got from a uh, creative, so I thought he wouldn't give you shit enough. But for some reason, he did care about it. Because at the end of the day, it was from creative. So I thought maybe it might have been like a bit. But like, nah, he, even if he uh, had to go on creative and stuff to get it. Basically, at the very beginning, he died when he had four diamonds. And yeah, uh, for some reason, uh, I'm pretty sure why he took it so serious. So I decided to do. If he was going to take so serious, I decided to, uh, why don't I make it into an interesting video? And that's what I've done. I decided to make it into a video. But, for some reason, guys, I didn't really, I don't think, realised I was going to make a video until actually the very end. Because I was going through the time and I was giving hits like, oh, come on, you got to make it. Insane. Oh, and if you look at this clip, guys, uh, yeah, it puts me in a box with a wyvern. What? Yeah, I don't know, uh... He, this wyvern, I don't know if it's still in the world. Because he's trapped in his box with a wyvern, and if you look at it, it's like trying to shoot the balls, and yeah. But it glitches out the roof. Basically, meaning, I think in his world now, there's a wyvern, because he did two, and I think this, he only killed one of the wyverns, unless he did go back again. Yeah. I think right here, she's glitched her. I think right here, glitched her. Basically, like, really soon it's going to glitch and I think the Wither might still be wandering around this world. I'm not feeling sure. It could be. So, yeah, uh, that was Fireblade's first attempt, I uh, think. I don't think we really would notice I was recording. We can't even really do it, but it was like, yeah. So, yeah. That Wither now is, a uh, cool, basically loose. Uh... Basically, uh, in the world somewhere, I think it might go there. But yeah, no, I just got out of course because you did probably do on the floor. And then I decided just to, uh, for some reason, uh, build a, a little thing around here. And the wither, literally, I think it's right by me. Something like that. So yeah, that was a uh, fireblade's first attempt. But uh Yeah, as soon as uh the first things happened, the main reason also I took that diamond pickaxe is as soon as I joined he was like just killing me and stuff, just he was basically just saying he went to his test I suppose and stuff, but it's like if you really want us playing I don't think you would maybe ki get killed with time, so at the end of the day it's like you can't take once people do stuff to him you can't take care. Uh, so it's like, if you can't take stuff when people do it to you, then don't blame me and complain over the time. Though, so, uh, and yeah, put me in another box with a wyvern. Well, I think this wyvern almost got out, I think. But because of the other one got out, I think something like that, he decided to basically kill her before I could actually escape. But, uh, yeah. That woodbine is hopefully gonna die. <laughs> Soon, I think he's probably break out. Break for a while. Yeah, he has a, a window. Yeah, I'm not really fully sure what happened. Uh, if I did this yesterday when I actually did the thing, I would have uh, done it properly, but uh, what would have remembered some of this? Yes, yeah, so that was the second one Fire Blade did for me. But, uh,. Yeah, and for some reason I think because of how that room was, it basically spawned me outside the room. Well, not outside the room, it spawned me at the beginning. And stuff like that. And uh, his house is a uh, kind of big block roof for it. At that point. I don't know if he's anything else to it, but 
yeah, I, I've kind of just gone fed up on Minecraft this point, it's kind of gone a little boring. We can never make uh, an actual save in this game. Well, me and Dave can do it together because we're how weird it is. One of just me and Dave, I think Pew makes a turn down for a bit, but yeah, that surprisingly, that would uh, me and Dave have managed to get along and uh, we didn't really care if she had anything. We just together actually felt like I was trusting her, but like, uh, well, one of us or four of us, it always ends up with them complaining to me about things when they're doing the exact same thing too, or basically just makes them a hypocrite. Well, I have noticed recently a lot of the thing we're doing mainly is just doing the complaining me about stuff, but then they do it. But it's like, if they try to do it back as like a. because I do something like that, then it still makes me creep if. Uh, yeah, but I don't really give a shit about it much. Plus, I've been playing a lot more games recently just because just uh, I've started playing other games, so I've started trying again. So, uh, so that's quite good. So at this point, you see your zombie pigmen are uh, sitting down there. Just uh, sitting there, just like. I said the punch them just because I went to, to see how things would go. At this point, I see Dave just coming to cream. We do go into another one of the end. Well, it looks like they made like, a gulag or something. He's planning on building. Well, I don't know if it's the best thing you should do in 20, 2019, add gulags to your map, but pff, if you want to do that, you can do it. So I decided to just keep on punching every time thing, because I think it's, I think it serves as nice to die and just have different screens pop Oh, he just uh, blew everything up. At this point, I'm saying he needs to entertain people. I don't think he realised I'm in YouTube at this point, but that, 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 that's okay. Yeah, I'm going to have this in there, not like... Right, uh, okay, no, that's another bomb. Oh no, that was creep. Yeah, he spawns a couple of creepers around. Not too entertaining out with the mere creepers, just some green things will explode. But yeah. I actually wonder if I shoot could defend against it. Hmm. I mean, the other day, though, their goal is to uh, defeat the Ender Dragon, but I would have helped. I would actually, I think, would play pr more properly some of my efforts. I think creative. Well, technically, it wasn't me the one who started it all off. It was a uh, Fireblade. So, by just because uh, as soon as I joined, I think five seconds in, he had me taught his place, but after that, he. Basically, just want to test his weapons out and just keep thing killing me and Dave and doing stuff like that. Well, yeah, if you want us to uh, help keep in the track, I think it's the, the best I can do. I don't know if he really needs help, he could do it by himself because he's in, he's gone into creative to grab stuff, so just go back in, grab a bunch of weapons and stuff. Should be good enough. But yeah, the, the main thing is, is like I just thought was you shouldn't be complaining about having to kill someone about to have a pickaxe because of you. Just, you basically just spawned their own through creative because you died with them and then you just got them back later on. You just went after you died from lava, you went back into creative, well, into creative to just grab some diamonds so you can rebuild back for diamond pickaxe. Well. Because he, I think he said that four diamonds, so I think he went one into a channel table he built, and three went into uh, his uh, diamond pickaxe. So technically, at, at the end of the day, he killed me for something he got in creative. Well, I don't think he's uh, fully think he's going to go back and grab another diamond pickaxe. But yeah, at the end of the day, I got this uh, good video I can upload. I was planning on doing this on my second channel, but I thought I could edit this properly and stuff. I could have to make it quite good and stuff like that, and uh, maybe call something like uh, Dark uh, Fireblaze Death Traps or something like that. 
I might have, well, it was somebody I mean, have just a feature in FT or uh, Fireblaze or something like Basically, yeah, this is this uh, prison I about. Well, through them burns, it kind of makes me feel like some labor camp or something like that. I've just had the built things laid out. But I have one part for like, hey, well, it could be. like I remember before doing a, a, a uh, escapist map or something like that, like making sort of escapist maps. I think it did make them before the first prison of the game made of escapist, made like a similar prison that I think I completed that stuff on the roof. But yeah, and this is a start of a death trap, like, I think this was a fourth one I did something like that, I did. But yeah, it's like, uh, for some reason we decided to go in this world war. If you say the massive fault war, it looks more like a gulag or like a prison camp or something like that. More than a, a fault, because it has bad wire around the buildings, like the prison prison things, stuff like that. Yeah, he makes, maybe, does probably make some weird traction. Well, you guys were seeing a bit, but, they haven't really hit it well, because through the obsidian, it's like, those are made of mine obsidian above my head, but, from above, you can literally see, like, drips of lava, going through, and, like, that's how the game works, so those drips things through, like, you see, well, I was looking at very saw some rain dripping down, like, the square, Blobs of rain. Basically, what happens with the lava is like it goes through into like square blobs of lava. Because at this point, you have to wait a bit longer. But yeah, at this point, uh, I think this is a fight. Well, this is Dave from Sandfire Blades' work at this point. Yeah, I decided to break the bottom just because that would be the best. That would be more entertaining. I decided to just keep on respawning in. Just uh, for something for me to do, if you know what I mean, just keep on respawning. Plus, I think there's some bits I was playing on Crash Clans or stuff like that. On my tablet, yeah, still play that game, guys. But I've started playing again after like two years of hardly playing. I've started playing a lot more now. Things from games, one tricks, and then all of a sudden, boom, it pops from Sap, just uh, pops some laugh down. Well, I wasn't amazing there. Uh, Best way, I don't know, I mean, just best of luck, and it's not that fancy, it's just plopping some bucket of lava, you know, lava just slowly coming down towards you, but I kill you, and you have a, I don't know, a feeling of where you have to get on something like that. <laughs> hmm, that's cool. But yeah, I think, uh, yeah, if you guys did enjoy this, remember guys to like, subscribe, and comment. Yeah, basically, at this point, we just see it, I'll just see it outside, so yeah. Just subscribe, like, and comment. I'll see you guys in the next video.